pretty sure that this is the kind of place that he found a fossil rock. I don't have a sonar, so... Aw, oh, dang it. Uh... Hey, it's Hino4 Funny. Um, I was trying to make like a little bit of a intro there, but I accidentally ran into a Magby. Not so good at my part. Now you may have noticed that the camera quality is what I consider way better. Because it's like uh, straight on. It's not like on its side, like flips. Like, it's like straight, if you know what I mean. Well, I don't know, if, like, the top screen does it still look good? I mean, this is flipped up, and this is flipped down. It probably looks better flipped down, but still. Uh, oh yeah, um, I think in the last episode there was a cutscene. I had to skip it because the video got too long. Like, it was just enough time to upload. And that's why I didn't include the intro, because, like, otherwise I would, it would not be uploadable. Oh, here's a problem. Huh. Uh, this tripod is getting in the way of my thumb moving the D-pad, so the tripod might move. Let me figure this out. I, I mean, I could try using the D-pad with my index finger. It won't feel very good, but I guess I can do it that way. I think, I believe, we have to go all the way back to the ranger base. I think I might have called them unions before when I really meant to call them base. Oh, did you just see my face in the reflection of the screen? Probably. Uh, this would be over here. Uh, wait, is that a Growlithe? Okay. Um, I think we have to go back. Uh, okay, maybe I'll go up north. How about that? I hate like when every uh, when you go to a new screen, the screen always goes dark, and it, like you can see my reflection. It re it really gets annoying. Like I used to back away because they didn't want you to see me, but I've already uploaded my YouTube survey, so it doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, but I don't want that to happen all the time. Every time I, yeah, so it's so close. Okay, we'd have to go back. Um, did you see the reflection in the camera? Maybe. Uh. Oh, oh, there's oh, Tyrogo. Oh, I almost ran into it. I almost made another stupid decision. Um. Cause we have to go back now. Wait, the mission music's still playing. Huh? I is there something, a part of the mission that I'm missing? Uh. Chase after the Shady Gang. Go east. Oh. Oh, okay, yeah, that's the part that I missed. So if you remember in the last episode that we saved those people from those Pokemon circling around them. Can I put my thumb in here? Yeah, you can probably see it. Uh, yeah. It's kind of hard to get my finger in the D-pad, I already said that. I can't believe I have made mention that this Weedle is still following me. What's that sign on the wall? It's like old fashioned. Um, are they over here? Did they already escape? Oh, wait. I, I see. There's still some machines over here. Oh, wait. Yeah, now I remember. Okay. So you go over here, and there's the Team Rocket Rejects, and they put this new yellow machine. Oh, boy. We haven't seen that yet. Very different. Over there, hey, they have a toxic croak, which we will have to quote unquote capture. Just explain what these machines are. Ratata, attack! Oh, come on, that's puny. Two, four Ratatas? Are you serious? Oh, you hear that? How is this moving? The camera, like, the tripod. I am doing nothing right now, and it seems to be shaking. Okay, n never mind that. You hear that music? Like, it's like, it plays every time that... Team Dim Sun sends Pokemon after you. 
This actually sounds cooler than the usual capture music, which gets really annoying after a while. Okay, so I'm gonna capture... Okay. Can I just make a giant circle? Okay. Okay, there we go. The energy bar keeps going down. It's, 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 you can barely make two circles. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna use a pokey assist. What does fire do? Oh, it burns them. I see. Like, they're scared or something? Okay, that seemed to make things easier. Thank you, Magby. I guess that wasn't a bad idea, catch, uh, capturing Magby, because his pokey assist is actually quite decent. Oh, we leveled up. I didn't expect that, because... I um, just started recording, like, I, f I did, forgot what my experience points were like. Okay, so, let me guess, you're gonna attack me with the Toxic Croak, right? Called it. <sighs> you know what? Oh, you hear that? This is, like, even cooler music. It's like a boss-ish theme. That's sort of like a mini boss. You know, I'm gonna start with a pokey assist right off the bat. A uh, fog thing. Puddles no stopping. That that was already a title in my video. It's like the last one. Oh, I avoided that. Pretty cool. Um, these gas bubbles. I hate them. We seem to be almost done here. Oh. Okay, I guess I could just use the pokey assist again because my bar went up. I hate those poison puddles. Oh, I captured them. I like how they just like poof away. Like, it's like really wait. It doesn't uh, up here it says. Uh, poison, poison. It doesn't even mention that it's a fighting type, like part fighting. Yeah, that's right. You run away. We've had enough. Let's go back to the hideout. So they just carry their machine away to the four of them. We we'll come back. You know, we could have gotten them faster if we didn't have this Munchlax following us. We only have to slow down because of him. Why'd you have to choose that Munchlax? Why? Oh. I guess that was her saying that. I was trying to imagine her saying that. Because, you know, Munchlax is a fat lord, so he tends to not run very fast. So he's like, come back. But this music indicates that we completed the mission, and... Wow, what an idiot. You're never gonna ca catch up to them if you just splash in the water and swim after them. You're an idiot. Why, why do you, why'd you do that? You're just gonna drown yourself or something. It's like Turok 2. Hate that game so much, you just drown yourself. It's not possible. Well, duh! Like, what'd you expect? To, for you to be the fastest swimmer? It's too dangerous. Okay, you do eventually go in a boat and then you go underwater, but it's nothing like Bottoms Up Bay. Wait. Huh? I didn't get voicemail. It, it sounded like I did. No, that doesn't do it. Um. Okay. What, what, what do I do? What do I do? Fuel Town, Bubba Ba. Might have to be so salty. I guess we could go up here. There's a Raticate, a Chadot, Ratata. He almost got me. Uh, did I move the tripod? Gosh. Uh, I think, um. Where. Uh. There's supposed to be an Eevee here. Or maybe that's just during one of the quests. Jump! Ah, oh, come on. Hit you, Wingle.
For some reason, Wingo reminds me of Coatless. Can you see that? You know, because Coatless, like with the wings and the you know, feet, it, it just matches. It's sort of like, I thought Aerodactyl was like Coatless, because it's like Fossil Bird, and Coatless is also a Fossil Bird, so it just fits. So, what? I want to go up here. Oh, come on, I hate these things. Why even bother? Ah, I still can't go this way. Uh, what to talk about? Oh, um, yeah, you know Taco Dude doing that, um, let's play of Fossil Fighters, and, um, all of a sudden, like, I, it was like this part 31, and, um, then he had, all of a sudden had this other let's play of something else he did with Super Jew that, like, came out of nowhere. Like, what was that? It's like, what happened to Fossil Fighter? Um, yeah, but I did end up getting that game, actually. Uh, it's, like, pretty good. Like, I cleared the chapters pretty fast. Uh, I'm, like, right now I'm in Bottoms Up Bay. You might be watching this. I'm pro I'd probably be farther by now if you're watching this in the future. But right now, in the day of recording this, I am still in Bottoms Up Bay, and I'm trying to, uh, like, use a pickaxe. It's the rocks, um, to find the secret holes. I, yeah, I, I, I'm still having to go through a lot of fossil battles. I, my team is, uh, Elasmo, Uraptor, Spinax, Megalo, and Lexo. I did have Urano, which is an Earth type. Um, but y yeah, like, I, I replaced him because I, Urano had higher attack, so I thought he'd be better than Lexo. And then I versed McJunker in the level up battles, and I was like, oh my god, he sucks. Alexa, we need you. So I ended up putting him back. Because you know why? He has the Cylinder of Death, which is like a really great move. I don't know, I, I, I was actually going to skip this part, but I ended up talking over it, because I get into these conversations sometimes. Uh, we could use you for a tree. Uh. Well, they both know Crush, but I'd much rather have the Tyrogue do Crush, so Venary, you were like the, one of the first ones I saw, so like, you're getting old right now. The Combi. Yeah, so we have to just walk all the way down here. You know what, I might actually do some of these quests, like, it won't count as, like, part of the Let's Play, like, I won't, I, like, I'll name it, but I won't really name it a part, I, I, maybe I'd say, like, Quests Part 1, and, and make it its whole separate thing, like, yeah, so, like, it won't be part of the main story, it'll just be, like, like, extras, but, like, even it, It'll only be like one video per quest, so if it's a short quest, it doesn't matter. That like if it's only like five minutes or something, I'll end it after five minutes. But like the ones that actually have to do with the story, I usually record in huge chunks. Oh, I guess I gotta end it. Um, so I'm 94 funny. I'll see you next time on Pokemon Ranger.